here and I could I need you guys no what's up guys it's me and today we're gonna do what's my bag my everyday carry bag that is so here we go this is the bag that we will be checking out today so yes this backpack is quite tall it's about you know my entire torso I'm a small person. But my favorite part is this. Look, look how how small this is. Like this is like my hand is bigger than this. This is not something that happens often. And it's not expandable, so I like it. And also, I had to put the flash on here. Can't go wrong with that. So, um before I go into the details, I'm gonna do the details about the bag as we start tearing it apart because you know, I just want to do things a little different than everybody else. So, uh, first things first, I guess we will look at the front. There is nothing on the front. There's no pockets, nothing like that in here. You have these little uh, these little loops every so often, so you can put stuff or attach things into, and these loops right here. I'll actually show you in a little bit what you can do with those. Um, move up to the back. We have some nice padding. Um, I wore this and it's, it's actually a lot nicer than it looks. Here you have just a little hoop for, I don't know, something, you know, I can put that S binder clip that I love on there. And this is really neat. I wasn't expecting this and I might actually use it. Um, more so like when I'm traveling or something, it's going to be way more handy than just walking into work and dropping my bag. This opens up, you unzip it, and... You, this is meant for your cell phone. Um, currently, my phone is not going to fit in there because of the case, but it fits most phones. I have an iPhone 10 with a Pelican case and a pop socket on it. So it's a little snug, but it does fit in there. But we will do that some other time. So moving on to the pockets. Right up here, we have a top pocket. And in here, I store my sunglasses. Um, it's not necessary to keep them in the pouch, but I do because you can never be too wrong, but these are some glasses I wear. Ray-Bans. Wayfair. I like think I look pretty good. They're all black, you know. These are just a standard Ray-Ban Wayfarers. Nothing special about them besides the fact that they're awesome. So, the nice thing is about this pocket is, um, you don't need the case and because I don't know if you'll be able to tell, but this has a really, really, really nice, soft, anti-scratch type of uh, material in here. And it's not very big. It's just big enough for me to put my glasses. So before we go into what really is the main compartment, um, well, I'm just going to go all over the place for this room, guys. We have this back pocket. Ah, that's all it opens, unfortunately. But this is a laptop sleeve. I currently don't have my laptop in here because I don't know if you can tell on the screen, but it's plugged in to the monitor. But, you know, if I'm not carrying my laptop, because I don't always want to bring my laptop to work, um, what I do is not necessary to bring it. So this is just, you know, where I keep a standard folder with stuff that I need more so daily than my computer at work. So, that's what's in there. Um, it holds up to a 15 inch laptop and well if it weren't for the width of this bag I could I try to push a 17 inch you know a little bit on the slimmer side not one of them big and bulky ones but anyways right here we have a side pocket it's not just any side pocket well first of all I added a little first aid kit in there just you know saying a little Johnson Johnson first aid kit because you're gonna find out in this pocket that I'm kind of like the overprepared mom in a type of way. Like, I have everything. Like, I have a first aid kit because, you know, you never know when you're going to get a boo-boo. If you get a boo-boo, you're going to need some band-aids. These are spider- you can't tell. Maybe. Yeah, these are Spider-Man band-aids because if you're going to get a little boo-boo, you might as well, you know, own it like Spidey would. But this pouch comes in here. And the thing is, I was looking for pouches to get more organized and whatnot, but then this backpack came with this pouch, and it's freaking awesome. So, this pouch comes out fully. And if you don't want to use a pouch in there, then you could probably fit, like, you know, some 
standard size tennis shoes in there or whatever. Well, I could because I'm small. And here's the pouch. The only thing on this back pouch is you have this orange strap. And guess what? This orange strap actually. Uh, you can actually slide this through and have this hanging off the front. Why would you want to do that? We'll get to that in a minute. But in here, this is not a camera pouch. Well, I guess it could be more meant for it. Um, but, like I said, I'm an overprepared mom. So, in here. Oh man, also, I like to. I just like to be prepared all the time, you know? Like, I like to. You never know what you can eat, so. I carry a toothbrush in here, toothpaste, there's some mouthwash, um, also some. Floss, floss fix, you know, you just never know. I have a comb in here, and you know, sweating. You know, I would put deodorant on every day, but you never know. Sometimes you just need a little extra push. Um, my face gets super oily, like unbearably oily, so sometimes I have to wash it throughout the day. Instead of going to the bathroom and making a big old mess, I just carry around these Neutrogena oil free cleansing wipes, and then I feel super refreshed. And then, I, you know, you just wash your face, I feel super refreshed, like, and I'm ready to roll for the rest of the day. So, um, lotion, because sometimes I get dirty, wash my hands a lot, so you want to keep the hands moisturized. Especially living in Alaska in the wintertime, this stuff is a freaking lifesaver, you know. But you got to take care of your hands. Um, you know, some Excedrin. Um, sometimes I get headaches. I ibuprofen, because if I or a friend gets a boo-boo. Uh, I have a prescription in here as well, and as well as my lady, my lady thing, which I will spare any males watching this. Big grief. Okay, but now to meat potatoes, stuff that you guys all want to see, is on the main compartment. Here, there's just a quick glance on my main compartment, so we'll, we'll start up here. In this pocket. This pocket, what do we have, what do we have? Ooh, yes. Um, keychain, I don't really carry keys in there, I like to leave them in my pocket. With this, you know, I gotta keep, I wear glasses, I carry sunglasses, I'm a nerd. Um, you need an eyeglass screwdriver because I can't tell you how many times I've used this. This thing is, is a lifesaver. If you wear glasses, you know that. Pack of gum, in case I don't get time to brush my teeth or if I want to chew some gum. Breath mints, because, you know, breath mints. You can't tell I want to stay fresh all the time. Okay, um, I always keep a pair of gloves with me. Sometimes they're in the backpack, sometimes they're in the pants. Depends on my mood or if the other ones get super dirty, which is why these are here now, because my other ones are completely soaked and they smell so bad. So these are actually really, really nice gloves that they give us at work. These are black, black hawk, um, work gloves, I suppose, but I prefer to use these in the summertime. I don't, I have a different pair for the winter, but these are deer skin and super pencilated and they're just great and they're a small pair of gloves that actually kind of fit me if they had an extra small be perfect but anyways so in here this is the gadget bag i have another one coming so we can upgrade later on but for now this 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 will do so in my gadget bag we have i have lots of portable chargers because I'm a freak who likes to keep this stuff charged up. Uh, whatever. This is a refuel one. I picked this up a long time ago and it's got some wear. Like I've used the crap out of this thing. I don't remember how much it was or anything. I will find out and let you know down below. Um, this is 7,800 milliamps. Um, right now I'm just keeping, you know, I know iPhone chargers and stuff aren't the best or whatnot, but I keep this stuff in here and I'm just going to use it until it breaks because it's not broken and don't fix it, you know? Um, there's a zipper pouch in here. I keep my iPhone dongle. Uh, we'll see what we got over here. Uh, this is my micro USB cable and I use this to obviously charge my uh, portable charger because I use an iPhone 10 and, you know, it's just don't need that. But yep, yeah, this is my Apple Lightning charger. And I know there's way better ones. I have way better ones, but I'm just gonna use this sucker until it breaks. Um, and then I have just a standard pair of Skull Candy, Skull Candy earbuds, and that's why I have the dongle. And you're like, ew, why Skull Candy? Because these are my budget 
headphones of choice. These are Skull Candy Ink. I've been using these honestly since middle school. There's another pocket back here, but there's nothing in here. Like I said, I'm upgrading this. I'm going to be constantly adding to it, you know, throughout time. But I'm glad I had this because before I just had this one big pocket in the front and I just threw everything in there. It was a tangled mess and things were going to get broken. I never knew what I had. Honestly, never knew. Like, I went out and bought a charger the other day because I didn't think I had a charger, but it was in the bag. So I got some organization in my life. Next thing up in this bag we have here, well, <laughs> there's a book actually right now. It's called This Is Your Brain on Music. I was uh, talking to someone about this, so I'm bringing it in for them to read. Uh, here I have, <laughs> this is a Corsar, I believe this is the M220 uh, mouse pad. Standard gaming size mouse pad, but I recently upgraded. And we'll talk about that some other day. So this is, I'm just gonna carry it to work because we have a mouse pad at work. It's disgusting. And sometimes I bring my laptop, so you know, just keep it in there, it doesn't take up much space. Um, and then you have this uh, iPad sleeve, will you? Um, I don't have an iPad right now. I just gave it to my brother. But this is my notebook for work. It's just a standard composition book. You can tell it's kind of getting beat up, but this is, you know, jotting down notes, learning stuff. Uh, this is just, these are moleskins. Oh, you can't tell, but it's a moleskin journal. And this is where I just jot down my ideas for you guys and my plans and whatnot. And you just never know if you're gonna need to write something down. But I love moleskin notebooks. This is just one of the really thin ones. They usually come in like a pack of three or whatever, but I've been using these for years and I don't wanna use any other notebook. Um, I don't know if I can get you guys a good view here. Uh, here, actually, these are just some pen pockets or whatever, so I keep a pen and a pencil at all times. Uh, and then this is a Mopi power pack, actually. Like I said, I have lots of different ones, lots of different views. Um, this one's how much is this? I can't tell. 6,080 milliamps Mopi power. So it has a micro. Oh boy, it's sliding. And the micro and a USB, so that's where you plug in if you were to. And so, if you're familiar with these, they come with a lightning. But hey, I don't use lightning. I use da da da, -da micros. Now I can charge other stuff with it. I can charge my other power bank with my power bank. And this is like actually magnetic, I found out. So if you're not using the lightning, you can just, wow, it's really blurry, I'm sorry. Throw it into the slot and it stays there. And then you just, button it all back up. Remember I was telling you that you could take the bottom pouch out, yeah, the bottom pouch out and stick it up here in case you need that extra room. So you can leave it with the extra room in there in a compartment like this as is. So you have this full as well as a separate compartment on the bottom. But also, it's very actually hard to do, which is a good thing. But I can keep a separate floor that separates the two compartments that goes down to where my pouch is will drop down. But it's actually, I'm not going to do it because it's extremely hard to get the Velcro off, which is a good thing because I want security knowing that my stuff isn't just going to collapse inside the bag. So that is my everyday carry bag. Now I know what a lot of you guys are thinking like, that's an awesome bag and all, but there's no room to carry my school books and whatnot. Like, know that this backpack is not meant to carry school books and whatnot. This is a very minimalistic backpack. So it's meant to carry your laptop, you know, and the laptop essentials. And I just kind of twerked it, twerked it, tweaked it to a way that suits me best. And all right guys, that wraps it up for what's in my bag. Now, I have a fanny pack video that I plan on getting out to you guys maybe next week or something. We'll see because I wear a fanny pack. Also, I plan on doing a couple others. If there's another types of videos you'd like to, what's in my bag types of videos you'd like, uh, let me know. Or anything else you want to see, let me know down below. And in the description, I will link all of the products that were featured here as well. Um, this is not a sponsored video. This is all me, stuff that I've had, and I do plan on upgrading stuff in future's time. But just give me a break, okay? I'm just starting. Anyhow. Thank you guys for watching, it means so much to me. Um, don't forget to share this video with friends, subscribe, all the good stuff, and I'll see you later.